the money thing for him. You know, I think that Spencer Fat Nick, yeah. And whether it's <laughs> wrong or I think he's just That boy Nick, Nick fat as fuck. That's it. Big yeah, I'm in here. <laughs> I don't mean, I don't mean, I don't mean here, there, boy. I still don't see the fight happening. Look at him. That nigga, nigga, fat than a motherfucker, boy. Look, man, Earl Spence giving this nigga Terrence Crawford and everybody around him fits before they even get in the ring, bro. <laughs> These niggas is having a bunch of fits and all kind of different type of shit. I see it. niggas panicking. If you just think about this situation... You know what I'm saying? This mean with Earl Spencer and Terrence Crawford, and you see how Terrence Crawford always react to shit to the fans or shit like that. Uh, he did it the same week as Earl Spence's fight. Two days before the fight, he went on live on Instagram, or he'll go on one of his Twitter rants. All that different type of shit. I believe Earl Spence is already in that nigga head, man. You feel me? Uh, and he look at Earl Spence like, man, this bitch ass nigga think he better than me. <laughs> He think he bigger than me type shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, that that ego shit. Like, and Earl Smith just cool, calm, and collected about the shit. And then you see how Terrence Crawford reacted to the shit. He go to the internet, and he wild out. That shows me that Earl Smith is in his head. Like, when, in a different type of way. Like, when Earl Smith had told Shine, like, that nigga fight like he drowning in a face-to-face. Man, that shit fuck shine up to the core, man. I'm talking about this nigga is a <laughs> he a nigga that know how to get under people's skin, bro. I ain't even gonna fake it, bro. Even though this is just negotiations right now. You know what I'm saying? Open negotiation before they actually get to the table for real, for real. And Terrence Crawford showing signs of frustration and weakness. That's what I see. You know what I'm saying? He sh- he's showing that he can't keep his cool right now, so he, Earl Spence giving him fits. So when they get in the ring, imagine what kind of fits he gonna give him then. <laughs> if he already in his head right now, I'm just saying. I'm just, I'll just be paying attention to certain shit, man. I know y'all seen been seeing all this shit. Y'all just ain't think about it like that. That nigga is is bothered, man. You ever been in a relationship with a motherfucker who don't like to argue? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Think about it. A motherfucker who like to argue in a relationship with a motherfucker who don't like to argue. Who you think is more bothered? The motherfucker who always like to argue and, 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 and talk. The nigga who don't even say something seems to always get under the other person's skin. And this is how this situation is. But a little different. I'm just saying. One nigga is barely saying shit. He hopped on camera the other day, last week. That nigga said, look, he going to take 60, 40 or 70, 30 or whatever we give him. Kept the shit short and sweet. You hear me? Bud went on this motherfucker. I told y'all. I told y'all it wasn't me. It wasn't me. <laughs> Face ass nigga. It, it wasn't me. I told y'all niggas. You know what I'm saying? It ain't happening. It ain't happening. He said that same ass shit before Earl fought Danny. And then skipped his goofy ass to Dallas and went to the fight. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> the nigga, the nigga, the nigga be bothered, bro. He, the nigga is frustrated. So when he get in the ring, what you going to see is Terrence Crawford trying to knock Earl Spence's head off, right? Fighting like he usually do. He gonna be in that motherfucker. Watch the whole build up to the fight. The nigga, he gonna be the mad one, bro. <laughs> Earl gonna be the, the nigga he always been, and Bud gonna be the mad nigga. He gonna be he gonna be the nigga that that that's hot. You know what I'm saying? And that's how it's gonna be inside the ring. So he's gonna be mad. He's gonna be wanting to beat Earl Smith's ass. Earl Smith's gonna jab the fuck out that nigga, and he gonna back his ass to the ropes and start landing combination hooks to the body. And hook back up the top, and, and Bud gonna want to bang, and he gonna get stopped. That's how it's gonna go. That's how it's gonna go. <laughs> That's the prediction. <laughs> That's my prediction. You know what I'm saying? The nigga gonna wanna, he gonna wanna fight. 
He gonna want to fight. He gonna want to bang. Fuck box. He, he gonna want to bang. And he gonna get fucked up in the process. That's what's gonna happen. Cause he, cause he, he, it's a lot of feelings involved. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of feelings involved. Remember what I said, man. Bruh giving this nigga fits already. And I ain't even in the ring, man. I ain't in the ring. Imagine what he gonna do. Or what kind of fits he gonna have with the jab. You know what I'm saying? With the left hand. With the body punch. He gonna have a lot of fits, bro. Bud, man. <laughs> is a hothead nigga, man. You ever went on a motherfucking lick? Or, or, or took one of your killers to a motherfucking party or something? Always that nigga who get into it with somebody in that motherfucker. <laughs> Cause that, and now y'all niggas in the shootout outside and shit. Cause, cause, cause of this nigga. That's Bud, man. <laughs> Bud, that nigga. Bud, that nigga. They, they always get mad, bro. You know what I'm saying? And and the weakness to, nigga, to high head niggas, you feel me, is always the niggas who, who. Who cool, calm, and collected? Cause Earl gonna win this battle, man. This this this, this sixty forty shit and all this shit we talking about. You know what I'm saying? This nigga gonna he he gonna win this battle, and then not only that, the shit probably when it's gonna be it's gonna be like a moment of silence. Everybody gonna stop talking about sixty forty and talking about the money shit, right? I'm talking about like. Earl and, and, and Bud and Bob and everybody else gonna stop talking about the shit. That's when you know that Bud actually took the 40, bro. Because they ain't gonna say, oh, I just took the 40, what's up? Type shit. Because they don't want niggas to know. So, they, it's just gonna be like a moment of silence. They gonna stop talking about it. He gonna take the 40, but he gonna take it personal, too. And he gonna get in the ring. He gonna wanna knock Earl Smith's head off. He gonna get fucked over. That's how it's gonna go. That's my prediction. <laughs> I'm out, man. Hit that like button, man. Say bye bye to fat neck right here too. That nigga neck make his ears look small. And then they got a half an eyebrow. That nigga be eating way too many turkey legs and shit, bro. And his head a little ashy or something. I don't know. I'm out, man. Peace. <laughs>